All right, so this is my favorite way to save money on groceries in Canada with minimal effort. This video is not at all sponsored. There are a bunch of websites and companies that do this. In the US, they call it Misfits Market. Where I live in Ontario, we use oddbunch.ca. Again, not at all sponsored. There's a bunch of different companies, but basically, they resell you the fruits and vegetables that they weren't able to sell in the store, maybe because of the shape or the size, or they bought too many of a product. One time we got a big bag of potatoes that all looked like they had nipples on them, for example. It was hilarious, but they were perfectly edible. Do keep in mind that these are not produce that's like at the end of its life. This is very edible. It's going to be good in the fridge for at least a week. Let me show you what I got. I get the medium size box for $35. I haven't done the math on this particular box, but I've done the math on boxes before. And sometimes I'll get as much as like $70 worth of fruits and vegetables had I bought them at an equivalent store like Walmart or No Frills for $35 and they deliver it right to my house. This time we have kale, which I do not know how to use. <laughs> so if anyone has any tips for how to use kale. Also, one thing I like about this is it takes all the mental labor about deciding which fruits and vegetables am I going to get? No, I get fruits and vegetables. And then I need to make it work as best as possible. And I get to try new things, which is kind of fun. So huge thing of asparagus. This is really expensive right now. So it's pretty exciting. We have a whole bunch of oranges. I'm not going to take them all out because they're going to roll right off my counter. A bunch of big old tomatoes. I do believe there's about four or five in here. A bunch of sweet potatoes. A huge thing of romaine lettuce. So that will be fun. Lots of good greens. We have blueberries, we have mushrooms, we have three cobs of corn. I hope that's how you say that. A cute little baby butternut squash. See, this one wouldn't sell as well in the store because it's too little. And like these sweet potatoes, people are gonna be like, oh, they aren't like large enough, but they're perfectly edible. And so if I can save money, a big old thing of cauliflower as well as a melon. So that is pretty good. Some weeks I find that it's better than others, but they're always worth the $35. So definitely something to check out if you're in Canada and you're struggling to keep your food budget down. They have different size boxes depending on your needs. So pretty cool. They even have an organic box, but that is not yet within my budget. Someday, someday. 